Good day, YouTube, and welcome to another episode of the Albino Rhino Beer Review. We are here on location at Tooth and Nail. Right is Guy, drinking in Canada. And we are drinking the second beer, which is, uh, oh, it's, a, it's Tenacity. It's a pale ale at 5.5% alcohol by volume. See, it has a tiny bit of haze, but is that chill haze or actual haze? Uh, chill haze, okay. But it's a nice color. I love my wife. I think she's an amazingly beautiful woman. I like that hair color on women right there. I'm sorry, Alicia. I love you. <laughs> this uh, can be bought on YouTube. <laughs> Could be. I love your shirt. Thank you. It's a little piney and almost like a honeydew note on there. It's piney, but almost like a tabletop cigar paper. I really like these cups. I have some of these at home that I use when I do some reviews sometimes. They're so much better than the just straight cups we had at Beyond the Pale. Yeah. Anyway, sir, slanche. It's it's pine, it's earthy, it's dirty. It's a caramel sweet. It does have some caramel to it and it also has some honeydew. I like that. Beers for beers. Oh, the nice too. It's a solid drinking beer. Yeah. I mean, the fruitiness would come out more if we let them up more. Honey, too. That's, that's See, I like the taste of that more than I like the taste of the Pilsner. I gave the Pilsner a 7 saying, hey, I would buy it again. I don't know if I would buy that one again, though. I, I like it. I just don't know if I would want to drink it more often than I'd once or twice. I'd drink it once if I'm eating something much Yeah. Yeah, I agree with you. For me, that's probably a six, seven, five. I could drink it if somebody bought it, but I wouldn't want to buy it again. Because it just... I don't know. It's good. But it's not a, oh my, I want to pay my money on it. It's not a sexual thing. No. Almost like a seven, but... The That's it. Yeah. Alrighty guys, Mercy Buckets. 